A housing state of emergency now and a freeze of rent prices. Both are things the St. Pete group wants incoming Mayor Ken Welch to consider when he takes the oath of office tomorrow. And the group pushing for those changes says they should happen quickly as more and more people risk losing their homes and having nowhere affordable to go live as prices spike. This morning in our ongoing series, Price of Paradise, ABC Action News reporter Chad Mills joining us live. Chad, you asked the group how their emergency plan would work here to help people out. That's right, the group called the People's Council of St. Petersburg, and that group believes the state, uh, the emergency declaration would be beneficial to this city and allow it to get serious at, at addressing something it feels has reached crisis level. The gentleman we work with pretty closely, who's been a part of these emergency meetings, really said it best, I think, is um, People in St. Pete are in danger of becoming refugees in their, their own community as a result of this housing emergency. Aaron Dietrich with the People's Council also wants St. Pete to enact rent control for a one-year period. He says first, he'd like the St. Pete City Council to make the emergency declaration, and then city voters would have to decide at the ballot box whether or not rent should be frozen. According to the proposal, there would be some exemptions, perhaps for vacation properties and luxury apartments, but groups like the Institute of Real Estate Management oppose rent control measures and say they interfere with the free market. Here's Dietrich's response. You know, a lot of these conversations, frankly, um, I feel like they could be left for the debate class. Um, right now, what we're trying to do is find solutions. St. Pete City Council has already given the idea some traction because it voted six to one last month to study the idea of rent control in Dietrich's proposal. And Dietrich hopes the new mayor will advance that consideration when he takes office tomorrow. Incoming Mayor Ken Welch, who has COVID-19 right now, will take his oath of office tomorrow morning at 1115 in a virtual ceremony. Live in St. Petersburg, Chad Mills, ABC Action News.